Trinity High School has been educating young men in our community for more than 70 years. The college preparatory school is still guided by its core pillars, but it's looking to the future now in a big way. I'm joined by James Tora, the Director of Admissions, to tell us about the exciting things that are happening here. First of all, congratulations. Thank you very much. Success is all around us. There is so much to celebrate this year. There, there truly is. You know, and we're blessed with all that success. At the end of last school year, finished strong, and we were so proud of those graduates. And thankfully, this year's senior class has, has picked up right where they left off. And academically, celebrating governor scholars, celebrating national merit scholars, those students are excelling in the academics. They surely are. I mean, we have so much to celebrate already with this class of 2025, these seniors. It was a school record of governor scholars who were recognized. We just found out we have a record number of national merit scholars and those honored by the and recognized by the college board. And it really just shows that this senior class is doing great things in the classroom, but also within the school community. When you look to the success and you think, what is behind all this? What are the core things that are in place in the classroom after school that are helping these kids find out like who they are and and how they fit in here? You really have to take a personalized approach to each and every one of them. And that's what we do. From the day they take their placement test to the day they graduate, the schedule for each of those students is built around them to meet them where they're at and to help each of them find success. Then the teachers and the counselors really surround them to create this environment where they feel comfortable and then they find success. So they're learning through projects, hands-on learning, through developing problem solving and critical thinking and this hands-on box schedule approach to education plus those dedicated faculty and staff and counselors really help each student to find their path while they're here. There is such a difference between a young man freshman year and then from senior year and you probably reassure a lot of parents don't worry we're going to take care of your baby (laughs) he's going to be fine freshman year. What do you do that freshman year to ensure a smooth transition from eighth grade to high school? Yeah because it really is a leap of faith. Yeah. For every family, you know, you're talking about students enrolling from 70 plus different grade and middle schools from greater Jefferson County and the surrounding counties. So we make sure from the shadow day to open house to placement test to that first day of school that there's a series of events and opportunities for that student to feel comfortable. And each of our students make a smooth transition, but then quickly figure out where they belong and find success. Well, I know there's no resting on success here. You all are already looking forward to the future. What things do you have planned? We are very, very excited. We have some big plans in the future. In January, we're going to break ground on phase one of a brand new state-of-the-art STEM career center. One thing that Block Schedule did is it allowed us to expand our offerings. And when you can have students that learn differently, through hands-on project-based learning, things like STEM really gain popularity and students are able to get in there and do. So what this first phase of the STEM Career Center will do is it's going to expand our STEM offerings. There'll be more advanced STEM-related classes that we can do, but it's also going to add lab space. It's going to add equipment and these students are going to be doing more hands-on real world activities within class every single day and we're really excited about that we'll break ground in january on phase one phase one will open in august 2025 so we're really excited about that and in the end it's only going to help uh, these young men build upon their future their ability to get jobs to get into college to do great things in our community that's exactly right when you walk into these stem classes now you can see firsthand how they are learning by doing they're developing those critical thinking those problem solving skills that's preparing them to enroll in colleges with stem related degrees but also some transferable skills that'll make them career ready if that's their path so these students are doing everything's like building wind turbines that they'll be able to charge mobile devices on they've built devices from scratch that they could dump a bag of skittles in the top and it would automatically sort them by color cars that move the things that they are doing are through the roof and we're preparing them for careers that don't even exist yet future sprite here yes it is thank you so much if your son would like to learn more about trinity high school he's invited to shadow 
and attend the open house on November 10th from 1 to 5 p.m. The high school placement test is December 14th at 9 a.m. To learn more and get started, go to trinityrocks.com. 